birthday peeps happy birthday my darlings happy birthday okay my darlings all right this week is the third week it's a week of the air week so however and whatever is transpiring it is a week of the hair week uh the quartal readings are out so go check out the quartal readings um let's go in and see what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring now ladies and gentlemen i have to warn you that on sunday the 22nd because this weekly reading is from the 16th until the 22nd all right so um what is going to be transpiring and what is going to be happening um with this reading and what is um coming up is that you guys are going to be having a new start so whatever the situation is whatever that is transpiring a new start is definitely going to be coming up for you guys it's um look really wonderful what is coming up and what is transpiring it is as if the universe is stepping in i see positive alignment of energies is going to be coming in and um the energy of the lovers um what is going to be transpiring is that this is going to be a new start for you pisces all right so pisces season is over in on sunday is the energy of the sagittarius the aries okay so pisces season is over in and the energy of the aries is coming up so pisces um on sun um the last the 20 22nd because the 21st begin the pisces so from off of, saturday it is the energy of the pisces so we're changing from water until fire this is going to be a good good message that is coming out um so be aware and align and i'm sorry i do this on camera but sometimes i am my brain goes faster than what i'm doing i swear to god my brain goes faster okay so ladies and gentlemen happy birthday again this is your solo your reading for the pisces and the aries aries begin on the 21st uh-huh aries begin on the 21st of october all right so happy birthday again you're going to be having a, a year from a new start whatever is transpiring so let's see what is coming up all right so we have judgment call we have the angman energies those are pisces energies all right so um and then we have uh your successful over a situation a tower moment is here it is looking good two four six four seven okay all right so um this is it so i see that whatever the issue and the situation is and i hope you guys can see this this card is that it's going to be okay because I see justice comes up. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, you're going to be having the energy of justice. Um, whatever situation, unbalanced situation, I see this unbalanced situation is going to be transpiring. You are going to be having the energy of justice coming up. So let's move in and um, check out what else is going to be coming up. Remember that, um, and I, I'll do it like this, the last two energies um is the aries the energy of the aries okay the energy of the aries so we're going to be looking first at the people who were born the 16th of march what is your messages so i see some judgment call on a gemini and i see a lot of energy of uh, whatever is transpiring for the people who were born on um the 16th i see um information is going to be coming out whatever um was there i see information is going to be coming out now this information that is going to be coming out a lot of information is going to be coming out for you people who were born on the 22nd so i see a huge amount of information that is going to be transpiring and the information is from an investigation that has been done okay there was an investigation that has been done and some information is coming out so 
you guys could have been dealing um, with um, the energy judgment you guys could have been dealing with the energy of uh, you trying to figure out something some um, energy of uh, so, some of it could be mental conflicts uh, for the people who are born on the 16th of March or you're trying to figure out things now whatever is transpiring is, is as if in this year you're going to be receiving the information that you were waiting for whatever that was affecting your life you're definitely going to be receiving the information that you were waiting for and I see uh, you are going to be coming out on top because whatever is happening and transpiring you're definitely definitely going to be coming out on top I'm going to be leaving um, um, the um, a picture of your reading so that you can have it okay it takes a longer time to bounce but I realize if I'm gonna be on camera I have to do this for you guys so for the people who were born on the 30th it is all about communication it's all about information coming at you you could be re if you're creative writing a book and that sort of a thing I see that this is going to be absolutely absolutely a fabulous year for you guys which is going to be creating balance in your world okay so whatever uncertainties that you guys have that this is going to be changing because I see information is going to be coming in that is going to be bringing you balance that you are going to be finding out whatever that was happening I see changes is coming in okay so a lot of uh, communication is here for you who were born under 16 a lot of information a lot of it where you're standing you're finding out the um, things that was happening and transpiring and you are making um, changes to these issues and situation and it is looking good now your energy is five there's changes there's changes there's transition changes in relationship changes in all situations around you however that is coming up and plain for you people who were born on the 16 you have two and you have five which is seven you're going to be on the right direction moving forward okay success is here you're going to be successful whatever you choose to do for the people who were born on the 16th of March in this year whatever you were choose to do I'm trying to figure out how I'm getting the light whatever you were um, choose to do okay I hope you can see the energy of the Sun but I'm going to take a picture whatever you were choosing to do is going to be absolutely um, fantastic because I see truths are going to be coming out information is going to be coming out that is going to help you guys you have the energy of the Sun that is giving you a positive news start moving you on now congratulations so you have 31 for uh, five and two okay 31 four five and two as we look at the people who were born under 17 I see some news is coming in it's gonna be some of you um, news is gonna come in um, if you're worried about your child I see news of money is going to be coming in I see if you have a business you're going to be making a lot of money however this is happening in transpiring I see news money is going to be coming in an offer of money is going to be coming in for you because they um, it's as if some of you some information is going to be coming out now the energy of the hangman is a beautiful energy because the energy of the hangman is helping you to go within and find it out and creating your world so if you're a creative person whatever creativity that you do in this year it's going to be beautiful because what is going to be happening and transpiring with these creativity that is happening and transpiring you are going to be finding out that your world is going to be changing you are going to be the the, the game changer because you have your own energy vibration and you are going to be the game changer so there is a lot of uh, situation that is going to be happening a lot of situation that is going to be transpiring this situation is good because this situation is going to be creating a lot of stability and I see especially for business people some of you could be climbing the ladder for business people this is looking good so if you're a business person who were born under 17 this is actually a fantastic year because I see your business is going to be ex, um, excelling and this business is going to be excelling in ways that you never expected to excel and this is looking good okay this is really wonderful it's looking good if you um, 
if you are hoping and looking for a management position this is the year that it's going to be transpiring I see um, it's as if this year is going to bring you guys a lot of money um, I see some of you um, save to send your your child to college and it's going to be happening um, I see that some of you were hoping to buy um, a new car a new home move by another a second home it's going to be happening okay now I see some jealousy so you've got to be aware um, as a whole lot of jealousy um, there could be someone on the work floor that some of you are dealing with a woman or a man in power very jealous person you got to um, stand back be careful because there is a lot of jealousy that is happening and transpire but I see you're gonna be clearing the way clearing the way opening up and um, clearing the way because whatever is transpiring and happening yeah, sorry that's how it should be that's why it keeps arriving up whatever that was transpiring happening it's going to be okay so money is going to be the name of the game for the people who are born under 17 money is the name of the game and I see you're going to be creating your own financial um, stability and this is going to be absolutely absolutely fabulous okay so your number and be careful of a woman a very jealous woman around you this is someone in power or in a management place so be aware of this person now you have the energy of seven you have four you have one um, you have eleven and you have twelve and three again twelve three eleven one seven and four these are a lot of numbers you can use this number for time making appointment um, you know making deals that sort of a thing as we move to people who were born on the 16 you have the most beautiful energy which is the energy of the Sun and the Sun is um, um, you know is opening up on your financial section so for you guys it's all about new financial stability that is going to be coming in your world this is going to be wonderful it's going to be very positive because your finance your money is going to be looking good um, I see money is going to be coming in money is really going to be looking good and it's going to be affecting like a lot of you guys um, so the worries about money is going to be over so if you guys had some issue worrying about money the worries about money is going to be over because what is um, transpiring is that your this year is a year where um, whoever is born in this week from the 16th until the 22nd you're going to be creating your own financial stability I see the energy of the hangman where your spirit guides are going to be coming in so you guys are going to be very very lucky whoever is born on the 18th of March this year is going to be a very lucky year for you it's going to be a year of success but it's going to be a year if you're a psychic this is where your gifts are going to be coming in and balancing out and it's going to be super 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 powerful okay so it doesn't matter whatever you have been going through it doesn't matter the issues it's as if right after your birthday from the 19th to the 17th of next year it's gonna be absolutely fab fab and more fab darlings okay so your number is 19 10 8 um, 1 and um, 12 and 3 all right so again three twelve eight one um ten and nineteen okay so let's see what is your little bonus that is coming up that you whoo bam 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 <laughs> so uh, money sun the sun the page of pentacles of money bam 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 it's a year you're gonna be creating like money is gonna be coming to you like whoa what have I done it's as if the universe is going to be opening the money tree for you guys so enjoy okay so we're looking at um, the people who were born on the 19 the energy for the people who were born on the 19 is that something is leaving your life this thing has to leave your life in 
order to make new start so whatever is leaving your life this has to leave your life in order to make new start because what is going to be happening and transpiring is that there was a blockage there was something that was blocking your life and now it's leaving as it leaves it is going to be removing um, some issues that you were dealing with okay so this block is going to be um, just removing the issues you were dealing with this block has to do um, with you men especially men 50 years and older or men on a hold something is going to be leaving your life whatever this issue is is it a relationship is it a business partner is it a job is it um, a study that you are finishing is it a long time issue sickness it's leaving your life and your burdens is going to be over this for some of you men is coming up as a relationship that is ending in your life and your burdens is going to be over okay then we see whatever the hardship is and the hardship that you um, you guys um, that was born 19 of March is going through um, this hardship is going to be ending and it is going to be moving away because a tower is like a shift of energy that is coming in for this year for you a shift of energy that is going to be removing you out of a, a negative situation so this shift of energy is coming in to definitely move you out of a, a situation that you have been dealing with some hardship that you have been dealing with that um um someone else it could be another water sign but I see that this hardship is going to be leaving your life and then you're going to be seeing that money is going to be coming in. Whatever this hardship, the situation is, this block that was there is leaving your life and then money is going to be coming in. So this is absolutely fabulous. I see that uh, um, you men, a woman could be leaving your life that was creating blockage in your life. So if you are born on the 19th, I see this woman leaving your life that was creating some blockages okay or this woman could be removing the blockages out of your life that was creating you from moving forward so the energy of the tower is number 16 um so you know the tower a lot of people are afraid of the tower but this is good because it was issues that you guys have been dealing with and this is removing so whoever this person is and whatever the situation is that was affecting your life this is definitely going to be removing away from you and i see positive alignment of energies is going to be coming in so congratulations both men and women um you're going to be feeling that effect is it number 19 is always the energy of a new cycle and this year you have a new cycle where transition is coming up so use the energy because it's going to be beautiful all right so let's move forward um to the people who were born on the 20th of march you're going to be dealing with some family issues uh, issues with relationship love soulmate twin flame this is coming up now what i'm seeing is that there is uh, ooh, some deceptive play that is going on okay so some of you could find out that your um your partner is cheating however way this is coming up i see the energy of the devil you're seeing this person for who they are and um you're going to be receiving help so definitely they realize um you realize that a woman some of you could have married to this aries Lee or sagittarius woman has done some deceptive thing whoever this person is they found out so this could be a mother figure a wife an ex-wife a sister some female energy um is the energy of the devil has done some deceptive thing and now i see help is going to be coming in in order to balance out this issue so i see a lot of help is going to be coming in for you people who are born on the 20th um because it, it you know and if your mom gets sick and she's an aries they are sagittarius it's negative forces and negative energy that created the sickness i see a resolution is going to be coming in because it's as if people um, is going to be finding out what is happening. She's not going to die if it's your husband or wife. She's not going to die because people are going to be finding out exactly what has transpired and they're going to be resolving the situation. Okay, so people 
are on top of it finding out and this is why justice so justice is like things like these that all of a sudden your mother your wife your grandmother just fell sick and nobody knows what it is and i see that a resolution so whatever um relationship problems with your wife relationship i see a resolution is going to be coming in i see people are going to be coming in and help you to resolve this issue and this situation so it's good for you people who were born on the 20th so you have 33 it's a master number it's a master number and it's letting you that i beams are going to be coming in and and divine intervention and help you or your family member or whoever this person is or whatever this issue is to remove you out of the darkness okay so you have a power number number 33 call upon the ascendance masters and what you have here is that help is going to be coming in because a Taurus is going to be helping you to resolve a situation, okay? And that is going to be wonderful. So a Taurus is going to be coming in to resolve a situation, and that is good. So water sign people, this is absolutely fabulous. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, it is a beautiful alignment of energies. So um, this is going to be good money is going to be, you know, whoever had financial situation this year is a year where money is going to be coming in. You're going to be opening up your world and a lot of money is going to be coming in. So this is the end of your Zodiac year for the year 2020. I will speak to you guys in 2021. You can still check out my reading. These readings are timeless, but this reading is a reading that is based and programmed for people um that was born 16th of march until 20th of march and the last pisces we have we see that you're dealing with some transition so the last pisces person on the 25th but it's not really pisces because pisces is a, so you're a cops person you're pisces kin pisces aries um the person who was born on the 24th what we see you're dealing with, you're dealing with some regrets, a situation is ending and um, you are sitting down there, you're looking at what you have lost, you're not looking at what and you, you, you know, whatever you have lost or whatever you think that you have lost, it wasn't lost, you had it and they're going to let you know that it wasn't lost, um, it was still there so this is going to be good so communication is going to be the key for the people who were born on the 21st of march which is aries um pisces aries cops and i see justice comes in so i see a transition is going to be coming up some of you if you have a kid that is a scorpio i see whoever this whoever and whatever your kid has done i see a transition is coming up okay so I see some of you, your kids might be having some legal issue or someone who is a scorpion in your life is going to be having some legal issue um, that brings you in connection. So however it transpires, it's as if you are the person that is going to be helping them out. You have some regrets um, because this person is really going to be affected by the outcomes and the resolve and the outcomes of whatever that was transpired. Okay, so I see here, um, that some of you could be dealing with some legal issue okay some of you could be dealing with some legal issue but it's going to come to an end in the first six months so for the people who are you know born the 21st of March I see some legal issue you have some sadness okay um it's gonna be a year where a lot of you are dealing with some legal issue so if you were born on the 21st of May um if it's not legal issues issues with an aquarian gemini or libra and i see some of you need to communicate because if you don't communicate this and it's about a tef it's about a tef it's about a tef so people who are born on the 21st of march i see the situation is transpiring it's about a tef some tef some situation that has transpired i see they're going to be coming down on whoever has done this um deed and I see it's coming to an end, okay? So whoever has done a deed um, of stealing something or um, is it was it done to you, I see they came down on this person and I see um, it's as if they came down on this person and they're cutting it down and um, you're going to be um, released out of it because I see the energy of a new start and justice is here where you're overcoming um, certain issues in certain 
um, situation. So congratulations. For the people who are born um, March 22nd, I see they're going to be finding out the truth. I see you could be finding out the truth. I see they're going to be seeing the truth and finding out what exactly has transpired. So I see there, they are, um, it could be you or um, people could be finding out uh, something that has transpired. It could be you, but people are going to be finding out something that has transpired. Whatever is transpiring, I see that whatever conflicts that you were going through before you um, begin your birthday or whatever conflicts that comes up in this year, you're going to be clearly, cleanly resolving this conflict. It's, 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 it's as if you're going to be like, and resolving this conflict. And it's going to be absolutely wonderful and positive, okay? Because the conflict is now going to be just, it's, it's as if as the conflict comes in, I see the the the, the conflict is going to be resolved. A lot of you are trying to balance out things and there is a lot of issues, a lot of conflicts that is going to be coming up for you people that was born on the 22nd of March. A lot of conflicts is coming up in this year and a lot of things are going to be clear where you weren't aware of a lot of issues and things are going to be clear that you weren't aware of. So you got to be on top of your game, be on top of your game, because as you're on top of your game, you're going to be finding out exactly what was happening and what was transpiring because there was so much deceptiveness that was happening and was transpiring. And you got to, um, you know, like stand on top of your game and, and really realize, um, in this year, because this year is a is an energy of new start, and this is what I said to the people who were born on the twenty second. There is a lot of conflicts that you have to deal with it in this year. A lot of conflicts. However, this conflicts is coming up. A lot of conflicts because here is the energy of the conflicts, and this is what is um, showing up because um, you have the energy of the star, and some of you are going to be finding out and seeing things and healing from things, but yet still the conflicts is still around you. So I see a lot of you are going to be standing back for the conflicts, but a lot of you are going to be connected in the conflict. So you have to be aware of whatever is transpiring. Okay. So there it is. I see the conflict. Some of you, um, you could be ending the conflicts or whatever the conflicts that was, um, you know, around in your life. However, this is coming up for you. And however, this is transpiring. You got to be the one to stand in and hand this conflicts to whatever is going on. So justice is here where you have two major arcana that is going to be helping you guys. You have the major arcana of justice that is here, but you also so have the major arcana that is coming up. That is also the energy of the year that is giving you guys a new start. All right, so I have two cards and I'm using the same deck. This is card one. This is card two, okay? Card one says, if someone or something has hurt you, let God and the universe take care of it. Trust me. So if you use card one or you choose card one, if something or someone has hurt you, turn it over to God and let God deal with it. Some people... The source of all things, the universe, the infinity universe, turn it over. They will help you. Okay. Don't go fighting with people. Um, as we look at the energy for card two, it says, if you're in a negative environment, it creates a block and positive energies can't come through. So if you're working in a negative environment, you always know it because it creates a block. You don't feel like going to work. However, this is transpiring. Whoever you are, I don't see any relocation, but some of you could be moving in this year. Some of you could be finding um, that, you know, you're relocating, um, you're making changes. However, this is happening and transparency changes is definitely going to be coming up and changes is going to be happening. So card two is all about, you know, if you feel like as if you're in a negative environment, you know, it's going to create blocks. So you got to either move the blocks or or move out of that environment okay i love you guys i want you to enjoy your year the quarterly readings are up remember uh to join the channel um subscribe or turn on your notification buttons i love you guys i want to say namaste until next time i have so much 